Uh, what was the idea behind the uh, Forum of Contemporary Photographers? Uh, this goes back to 1992 when an exhibition that was curated by two German photographers uh, and was supposed to hang uh, in the foyer where the festival of India and Germany was going to open. The Department of Culture at that time took strong exception to the subject matter in those pictures. Uh, I have to add that this show that was curated, uh, called The Endless Wheel, was uh, curated several years ago. And it was shown in Germany and travels through Germany uh, and other parts of Europe. So it wasn't specifically done for the Festival of India at that time. But uh, the, the, the German counterpart to the Festival India thought that it was a good idea to have it. The Indians, when they saw it, freaked out. So as a result, uh, you know, uh, we felt that it was unfair on the Department of Culture to sort of impose a certain uh, norm uh, about the subject matter and then, you know, have it sanitized or whatever. So, as a, so we led a protest and a lot of photographers joined in, in this protest. Um, all of this culminated in a seminar in February 1992, uh, which was called the State and Status of Indian Photography. As a result of that, uh, we brought out a paper, uh, or several papers, which was uh, Sort of put together and uh, they detailed what the problems were, how we could try and remedy it and out of that the Forum of Contemporary Photographers came about to do its first project. It was during this time that uh, um, the North Zone Cultural Center who had funded part of this a seminar uh, invited us to Punjab. It was um, me and others who felt that we could do a day in a life kind of uh, say thing there, looking at the problems of a state coming out of terrorism. Uh, unfortunately, by the time we could get our resources and our sponsors together, a lot of time lapsed and uh, from February 1992, we finally did it in end of February 1994. So during that two-year period, uh, Punjab went through a further normalization. But yet, what we tried to do with the show again is, you know, try and go in to show the trauma that still remained, and of course the normalcy which has come back. So that's basically, uh, you know, the background to uh, the formation of the forum, and then a uh, project in Punjab. Uh, you are quite busy. How, how did you find time to do this Punjab project? Well, we all are busy, but you know, I mean, work uh, in the media is one thing, but a lot of us who work 10 years, 15 years, 20 years in this, uh, in the media, at least, uh, you know, I can speak for myself. Uh, I always look for other sorts of things to do because the working in the media is just one discipline. Uh, I mean, I do take off six months of a year uh, to do my own personal project. So, I mean, this is in a sense a personal project, uh, uh, except that it's a cooperative personal project. It's not an individual one. And so we do, you know, you have to sort of uh, maybe refuse assignments or stay up later at night or not uh, go out to party. Uh, can we expect such uh, collective projects in the future? Anything specific coming up? Uh, yeah, we hope. Uh, the basic uh, hurdle really is the fundraising. I mean, uh, we've looked to the government for funding and I'm sure we will be open to criticism on that account. But uh, I think we would like to go towards private funding more and more so that corporate groups uh, it could be foundations, uh, NGOs, uh, I don't know where, how and what, but uh, yes, we would like definitely to get money 
um, uh, to support this as an ongoing, uh, you know, venture or ventures. Thank you.